Alright, walk me through it. Just the emotions and everything that uh, came I mean, after. Yeah, I mean, it was a pretty unreal game. I mean, Sunday it was, uh, we had the day off Saturday, so we were rested up and everything. But, I mean, they came out, I mean, hot off of, off of Tyler. They were swinging the bat really well. And, uh, and our pitchers came in and fought throughout the whole game. And then uh, I mean, we fought back in the ninth inning, uh, put a good swing on a ball and tied the game for us, luckily. And, uh, after that, I mean, the momentum really just changed. The next inning, I mean, once once Seckler came out and held him again, we knew we we're we're getting some guys on. The pitch had been in for a while. And he was fatigued, so I knew we we're gonna we we're get the job done. So I mean, it was it was really a crazy game. It was awesome. Last year, you didn't remember the trip around the bases. Do you remember it this year? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember this year. <laughs> what was it? Was it? More fun? What was it? Uh, I mean, yeah. I mean, it was, it was still as fun. I mean, maybe not not as big as a moment as a regional, but I mean, it was still still awesome to do that with the team. We're just having these moments. Two of the biggest swings in school history. It's, yeah, I mean, it's I'm just glad I'm being able to put in that situation and uh, be able to come through. I mean, it's it's just an awesome feeling to be able to come through like that. Do you have a feeling when you were doing up, guy on that maybe maybe. A, I mean, it's always the back of your head when you have a chance to tie it, win it, anything. So, I mean, to be able to come through and be thinking about it a little bit, walking through the plate, I mean, it's awesome. What did you think of the draw today? Just getting uh, I mean, I think everyone thought we were going to go to Arkansas again, but, I mean, it is what it is, and we didn't go there. And I think we're all kind of excited to get to go somewhere new. And Ole Miss is a great school and a great baseball place, so we're all really excited. Is confidence seeing the other teams? Do you know much? Uh, I mean, I, I don't really know too much. But. I'm watching you here today, just like people patting you on the back. You know, it's Jeremy Ironman. You had the big moment yesterday. You just kind of, kind of hid back there for a little bit. Yeah, we did. We couldn't find a table up here, but yeah, uh, yeah. It's it's awesome. The support it was unreal here at Missouri State. So I mean, we're just all over really great for the fans that came out today and everything that showed up for us. And then of course you're bad, but you know, up mid, up the middle have just been. Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, we, infield wise, I mean, we put a lot of work in off season and this season, and I think it's starting to show a little bit. I mean, we made some good plays this this whole last week and everything. And, um, yeah. What's this year been like for you? The numbers, I mean, the numbers aren't jumping off the charts now like they were last year, but you're still having a pretty solid season. Yeah. How has it been different? Uh, I mean, it's. I mean. I, I thought I had a, quite a, like a breakout year last year. I mean, everything was everything was working for me last year. And this year, I've kind of fought through some different stuff in my swing and different parts of my game. So I mean, it's just been kind of a battle trying to get back to where I was. But I mean, we'll get back. Your strike are down too. I know that was something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's definitely something I'm working on, and I'm, I'm glad that part of my game is getting better. But constant, constant work and progress. Coming up with Hunter and Bill. Have you seen that uh, I mean, since freshman year, I mean, it's been awesome. I mean, Hunter always Hunter had a great year freshman year, and so did Dylan. And just throughout the years, I've been just getting better, and it's really awesome to see him progress as players and really going to go through the years. And this is the last time we're going to talk to face to face until the draft next week. And you kind of roll your eyes right there. <laughs> it's just like, how much of it? I know you're trying not to think about it. Yeah, I mean, it's it's definitely something that's in the back of your head. I mean, it's you want to perform well and everything, but I mean, it's it's gonna happen regardless whether you do well or bad. So I mean, I think it's it's something you gotta just put on the back burner and go for it. Sick of us asking about it. That's a good thing. Did you feel like you'd be this? I mean, this kind of a high profile guy. When did you when did you feel like you knew that you could be this? Uh, I mean. I kind of, I mean, me and my dad always, my dad's always kind of said, all life when you have the ability, you just got to kind of put it all together. But I feel like last year was the first time I really felt like I um, I could be that type of guy. And so, yeah, I mean, pretty much last year, <laughs> I felt like that. You're kind of clicking towards the end of the year now. I mean, just having the big moments, and you performed pretty well last year in the tournament, too. So how confident are you to be able to bring some of that back? Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm very confident. I mean, to go down to Ole Miss and uh, as a team, go down there and win and go win the thing, go to Super Bowl. So, appreciate it.